Hello friends, it is Monday and I'm going to go grocery shopping. I am going to film myself going grocery shopping. And uh, yeah, just so you can kind of get an idea of like how I'll clumsily go through the grocery store. Um, but also just the things that I get to kind of set me up for the week. And yeah, hopefully it might help you. Uh, let's just get started, shall we? get started. All right, so we're going into the grocery store right now for our grocery haul. I have my grocery list already written out in my notes on my phone before I even go grocery shopping. Not only help me be more efficient, but to budget, make sure I don't spend too much on food, and also just to categorize my food, see what I need. Oh my gold. So as much as I want this stuff, I know that if I go after it and have it in my house, then I'm going to abuse it. So it's good to recognize your trigger foods. For me, it's sweets. All right, so I ended up getting the Hood 4% cottage cheese. Even though it's not lower in calorie, it's cheaper in price, so I can get more for less money, and I'll just portion my food a little bit better since it's only like 20 more calories. So right now I'm looking for my fun item. So my fun item is going to be Reese's peanut butter cup covered pretzels, which I saw at the store the other day, but I can't find them right now, so I'm a bitch. But so if I can't find these off, I add something else for the fun list. But Kit Kats are always good too. But uh, I like to add something fun because what's the point of dieting if you're not enjoying it? Gotta have some fun, but something you can control. <laughs> and we're adding, we're adding these to the fun list because Mentos are delicious. Also fucked. Yes. Yeah, baby, yeah. Here we go. Four, five pieces, 140 calories. It's not worth it, but we're gonna make this work this week. And I will show you. Right, so I'm looking for protein bars. I'm trying to look for ones that I haven't had yet, but also ones that have good macros. So what I consider good macros for protein bars, I like 200 calories and under with 15 to 20 grams of protein per bar. This bar looks a little promising. It's a Think Bar. 20 grams of protein, 230 calories, not too bad. Lemon Delight. We like Lemon Delight. We like that. I'll try that. I will try that. There's a lot of Think Bars. Hmm. So what else we got? They have a S'mores Think Bar. So maybe we'll try that. Mm. No, 10 grams of protein. Not worth my time. That's not worth my time, man. Didn't end up finding jerky. It was like all the processed jerky, like Slim Jims and all that, which aren't bad for you, but I I don't like Slim Jims. Not a big fan. I do like the Trader Joe's turkey jerky, which next time I go to Trader Joe's, I will get those. But right now, I'm not gonna get the jerky. So we're all done. We are going to see how much it costs. Also, robots. Fucking robots, dude. Eight ninety-nine. Place your item on the belt. Oh. 
that was our grocery haul. Nothing too crazy, nothing out of the ordinary that's gonna cause someone to lose more fat or gain more fat. Um, just foods that I enjoy, foods that are kinda easy to make, and um, yeah, that's kinda it. It's all about portion control at the end of the day if you're trying to lose fat, um, maintain your weight, or gain weight. Um, that's the name of the game. So, thank you for hopping on this grocery haul with me. I gotta run, I'll see you later. Be well, be good, and peace.